this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today I am playing a round of Hunger Games on a map called Mario Universe Hunger Games. And no surprise, this is a Mario themed Hunger Games map. Uh, this was built by Mr. Mike B, and I am playing with Lion Maker, Mini God, Netty Plays, Stampy Llama Face, Page the Panda, uh, Hayden Hill, Hayden Hill, sorry, and uh, Tomahawk1989. And so everyone seems to be ready to go into their pods, I mean their pipes, <laughs> their Mario pipes, everyone's waiting for me, so let's hop in and let the games begin. We are going to be having a two minute grace period, uh, so there's two minutes where we're not allowed to attack each other, which is good, which means I'm almost guaranteed to survive for two minutes, and we are off, and that was a good start, already got a bow, no I didn't get it, I didn't get it, there we go, I managed to steal some stuff, oh get the iron, get the iron, get the iron, there we go, I got the iron, I get a fish as well, can I get some stuff from this chest, oh there's a, a, a diamond pickaxe there, that's actually really good, that's almost as good uh, as an iron sword, let's try and steal some stuff from Netty, oh look a fire aspect uh, a flower I got there, that was a, a pretty good start actually, a very good start if I'm honest, and a, a potion of slowness, and a, a fire aspect flower, and a cookie, and all sorts of grand things, and let's go, 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 I believe this is um, Luigi Haunted Mansion I'm running in here. I've never played this map before, uh, so I have no idea what it is we're going to be finding, uh, which is always the most exciting way to do things. And look, I got a, uh, another piece of iron. I could make uh, an iron sword if I wanted. Uh, but then again, as I said, I'm pretty sure, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, and I know you will, <laughs> I'm pretty sure uh, that the, whoa, that's a chicken. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that the uh, the uh, the diamond axe uh, is as good as the, uh, the iron sword, I believe. And oh, this is just a toilet with a creeper ghost in. I don't want to go in there. Yeah, I think this is, I think this is supposed to be the haunted mansion. But was of enchanting, uh, there's some more boots down here, oh some socks <laughs> down there, another bottle of enchanting and some arrows, oh and a stick actually, I need the stick don't I to make the, the iron sword, uh, so I might go and try and make that if I can, uh, I seem to be still being followed by a very big chicken so I want to watch out for that, is there anything in this room, nope just a, a very bright and uh, colourful room in here, and uh, this is the, the balcony where there are lots of anvils and oh there's a, there's a ladder there, could I, Hop. ooh 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 there we go. Ah, this is pretty sneaky, wasn't it? I can get up to the uh, to the roof, I guess, then. Is there anything up on the roof? Hmm, I think this might have just been a different way to get up here. Oh, there's some chunks here which aren't loaded in. I am not hosting the game, so I might have to every now and then uh, wait for some of the uh, the chunks to load in. But we're just going to have to deal with that uh, as it comes. And this is this is very spooky up here, isn't it? Oh, look, there's a chest here. Oh, I just got some scary music. Uh, I won't, but actually, let me see if there's a secret. Sometimes uh, when you play these music discs, uh, it may maybe opens things up. Or is it just going to play scary music? Nope, I think it is just going to play scary music. <laughs> oh well, at least we get some spooky music while we're up here, setting the mood, and we can go even higher. So I'm going to look up here, see if there's anything good at the top, and then I'm going to go and look at some of the other areas. Oh look, a diamond! I might be able to make a diamond sword if I get another diamond. There seems to be Bowser's castle, there's a Peach's castle over there, and I, I think that might be Wario's? Wario's castle in that direction? And oh look, there's another chest behind here. Please have another diamond in, oh that'd be too good. Oh a dog! Uh, there's a dog spawn. Oh no, it's a skeleton spawner and a bone. I think I just assumed it would be a dog uh, just because it was next to the uh, the bone. So what I think I really want to do now uh, is just try, uh, if I can, uh, to... Um uh, to get another diamond. I reckon there might be a diamond maybe on the top of one of the other castles. Maybe there's a diamond on top of each of the castles. That would be rather handy. Uh, is there anything uh, else good in here that I can find? And this is really funky music. It does actually sound a little bit like Mario music, doesn't it? And I don't think I've missed any chests in here. Uh, sorry if I have. I know you always tell me off because I always miss chests, but sorry if I missed any chests. Uh, let's go head downstairs then, shall we? Any hidden things behind the paintings? Nope. Right, how did I How did I get up here? I went up that weird secret ladder, didn't I? Uh, but surely there's got to be a, a different way you could have got up here, unless that was just the only way, and I'm just getting completely <laughs> lost now. Right, this is where I came in this room from, and then is there no way down that way? Uh, I don't think there is. I think the way I got up here might have been the only way you could have got up here. So let's go back down the balcony and uh, keep heading down this way. I got another potion of poison here as well, uh, which is even better than the, the last one I got, so I'm going to keep that at hand. I should probably also keep the uh, the ender pearl at hand uh, in case uh, I'm going to need that. Right, now let's see if I can find my way out of this house and then go to one of the other sides. We are now out of the grace period, which means that if I see anyone, uh, there's a good chance they're going to attack me. In fact, there's an almost definite chance they're going to attack me. Oh, look, I can attack them though. There's someone here standing in the middle, not paying attention. I got to go for them. Oh no, they're going to hit me off. They're going to hit me off. I was getting really knocked close to the edge there. Right, I got to go after them. <laughs> Why can't I get them? I don't think that they're just holding a piece of bread, I think. Right, go, 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 go. I'm just chasing ring around the rosies around the middle here. I want to be really careful that they're they don't knock me off. There we go. 
I was able to take them out though, and I was able to steal all of their things. And let's go to, let's go to Bowser's castle, shall we? This one looks rather funky, but oh no, there's probably going to be lots of lava in the area here. Whoa, look at this place. This place looks awesome, actually. Look at the uh, the size of it. Uh, I should probably get some, some food at hand, because I am going to uh, start getting hungry. So go and eat some of my num-nums. And this is, uh, yep, this is a chunk not loaded in here. Uh, so I guess I am not going to go around that way. Oh, look, there's a chest right here at the front, though. Someone's probably already got it, uh, but I might as well have a quick check just to see. Yep. Yeah already been looted. So what I really want is to try and find a, another diamond. And because this side's not loaded in very much, I might actually go to, to one of the other side. Let's go to Peach's Castle. Peach's Castle's probably a lot friendlier uh, than uh, Bowser's Castle. Let's go and uh, head this way. It looks like there is already someone's been in there. There's a chest here, but there's got that's got to be looted. Yep, definitely looted. I can't see anyone behind me. And also that Stampy Llama face was slain by Midigod. Oh, here's Tomahawk. Here's Tomahawk, and he hasn't seen me yet. I was able to poison, though. I was able to poison him. Let's go after him. Let's go after him. He's He's only got a wooden sword and yes there we go another kill i am doing very good at the start of this game i don't have any um more chest plates yet um but uh, this is still a, a very good start by me i've taken out two people already this um this uh diamond uh axe is really good and look we're going down the mario pipe do -do 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 -do. <laughs> as we go down and oh look we're going through the uh, the mario pipe let's go and uh, see what is going to be on the other side i mean my big challenge uh, is still basically uh, to try and uh, get myself a uh, the the other diamond that's going to be what i'm going for and what am i doing here i'm just making a mess of all of my inventory i was trying to get the uh, the flame sword back there and have i got a um an enchanted piece of gold i believe i do is that uh, yeah, a magic star with knockback. Oh, I could try and knock someone off a bridge or something. That would be quite cool. <laughs> I have so many interesting things I can use. And oh no, it looks like the uh, the chunk hasn't loaded in on this side here either. So let's just uh, keep an eye and make sure no one's going to sneak up on me. If I stay right in the middle of this pipe, then people shouldn't be able to, to come at me from either side. Uh, we do have gamer tags turned off, uh, so people won't be able to see me unless they're close to me. Uh, but after a certain amount of time, uh, we are going to then turn them back on, and then that way we can all go after each other. So here we go. My pipe has loaded in. Uh, so let's go and keep off heading this way. Uh, I've taken out two people, uh, but there's still plenty of people running all over the place. So I do want to be very careful. And there's a chest up here. Anything in this chest? Uh, nope, just a whole load of maps. Let's go and uh, put some more maps in there. That seems to be the map chest. <laughs> so let's just go and put all of these maps and things that I don't want in here. And uh, let's go and carry on. So is this Peach's Castle still? Or is this loop me around to, to somewhere else? I think I'm just in a completely different area of the map. It looks like a, a bit of a, uh, a ghost castle again to be honest and oh no this is taking me straight back to the middle I think I just went in one castle and out the other and oh look see on the top of there I think that's Nettie upstairs over there. Right, let's see if we can go after my sister. <laughs> it's part of the game. I'm not being mean. We've got to go after everyone. Uh, so as you, uh, I'm sure you know, it's basically the last person alive wins. And so to do that, you need to go and try and take out everyone else. And oh, look, there's lots of money in here. Look, there's lots of big piles of gold all over the place. And uh, I might actually want to get some more food soon. That is the, the one thing that I don't have too much of. And whoa, there's a massive piranha plant. <laughs> Oh, that is huge. Can you go in it? Can you go inside of it? I'm not sure if you can, but how do you get up on top of here? This is where Nettie was. You've got to be uh, able to get upstairs here somehow. There seems just to be a few little dungeons down here. Uh, a lot of these chests have had most of the uh, the good stuff taken from them. And uh, I got a, um, a few bottles of enchanting here, though, so I might actually go and splash these, get a few levels, and I might actually go and uh, try and enchant my bow if I can would be uh, pretty handy. And what did I have here? Let's just put some food here for now. And uh, are these levels? ladders are these gonna lead to anywhere i can get a little bit higher and get to the second floor here i've no idea how you'd get all the way to the top uh, i don't think anyone's been up here though these doors weren't open so let me go and have a look up on the uh, the other side as well uh, see if there was any good loot hiding up here any chests at all oh there is a chest and inside it is absolutely nothing what a waste of time <laughs> right so i'm still on the other uh, hunt for that that final diamond i guess then and oh is this ah uh, here we go this is how you get upstairs on this castle here i think there's just a good chance there's going to be a diamond at the top of all of these castles just because there was on the other one but uh, this is right where Nettie was and it looks like uh, she's already stole all of the uh, the good stuff from this chest here I will get the um the golden apple oh an enchanted golden apple even better that could save my life if I need it uh, but I don't seem to be able to get any higher this way oh no up there that's where she was I could try 
and uh, have a go ender pearling. If I aim a bit like this, I could throw an ender pearl up here and see if I could get up the top there and try and get that chest. Oh, I did it. That was perfect. That was amazing, actually. And in the chest, there is absolutely diddly squat. <laughs> what a big waste of time. Oh, I think you go up pipes. I think you go up pipes will lead you uh, to this area here. All right, let's go down this pipe then. Bob, 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 bob. <laughs> I, I love doing this. I love going down the Mario pipes. It's so much fun. I love this map. I love Mario as well. So it's cool uh, just being on a map themed around something that you like. Right, I want to be careful because I think this is close to where Nettie was. And whoa, this is a very long pipe. Let's see where it's uh, uh, where it's going to, to lead me to. The problem uh, with when I play Hunger Games is after a while, I kind of get into a habit of just looking around the map and enjoying wandering around. And then I kind of forget that there's lots of other people going after me. So <laughs> I need to remember that I got to stay on my guard uh, just in case someone tries to go after me and oh I think I've gone into a is this like a, a graveyard here and something shooting at me please just be a googly there's not someone around here is there I can't see anyone I can hear I can hear skeletons I can hear skeletons shooting at me I have no idea where they are and I thought this was going to be my love garden then when that big pink thing started loading in where are the where are the skeletons I have no idea oh well uh, let's keep wandering around here and see if there's uh, any more chests see once I got that diamond I think I'm almost guaranteed to win because then I can very easily uh, make a diamond sword and uh, there's not much better than a diamond sword and look another golden apple that is going to be very handy so basically golden apples when you eat them I'm sure you know this but I say anyway uh, it basically makes you uh, regenerate uh, makes your health go up much faster so if I'm weak somewhere I can quickly eat my golden apple and uh, that should help me out big time uh, in this chest here I got some boots I think I've already got boots don't I yeah I've already got boots I suppose the uh, the gold ones are slightly better so I might as well uh, go and put these on anyway it doesn't matter uh, too much though and uh, let's go and carry on wandering around and oh look that's what it was that's what the big pink thing wand was it was the back of this guy's tongue <laughs> it's just his big tongue there and is that all there is in this area do I have to go back through that pipe again uh, the one that I came here I think that might be everything that you can you can do around here and oh there's the skeleton standing up there on the tree there's the skeleton <laughs> and oh can I go in can I go in here Ooh, this might be some sort of hidden secret I feel like I'm going into some type of tomb I better not get stuck in here come on open please open door it opened for a second and there we go there we go now I have got inside Okay, where's this uh, Where's this going to lead to? I'm getting a bit worried just because I haven't seen anyone in a while. And I don't know, it just makes me get a little bit more nervous when I haven't seen someone in a bit. And uh, I think the only thing that I really want is uh, food now. And that diamond, of course. And oh, what's this? I've come out of the water somewhere and I heard a chest. Oh, look, there's someone right here. There's someone right here. Right, let's try and poison. That's Nettie. Let's try and poison her. There we go. I got a good poison on her. Can I hit her? She's really hurting me. But no, I was able to take her out. And she had that diamond. She had that diamond. She must have stole it from the uh, the top of that castle that I was on earlier. And she had some more iron down here as well. I'm going to grab that. I might even uh, be able to make myself some iron armor at some point. And I think this was the, uh, the chest that she was looking through. Uh, so I might just go and empty out some of these things that I don't need uh, into this chest. Oh, look, an iron helmet. That is going to be very handy uh, she had the iron axe that she was using and then that little bit of iron so let me just go and uh, throw away uh, a few more of these these things that I don't need another map there I'm probably not going to use that I'm not going to use the flint and steel or the socks and stuff so uh, and I don't need all of these bows I got more than enough bows so here we go uh, I've managed to sort out my inventory a bit and so now the next thing I need to do oh look at this look at this a little hidden potion down here this is a, a invisibility potion ah this could actually be pretty handy so let me have this at hand uh, invisibility potions don't work very well because they can still see your armor and uh, they can also see the bubbles coming off as well so they're not the best things in the world uh, but yeah they can still be uh, pretty useful they might be they make you less visible than if you didn't have one so it's better to have one uh, than to not so or she a bucket of lava as well this could also uh, come in very handy for if I'm trying to escape I can kind of throw it down behind me I guess and to uh, try and slow people down uh, so I can have that as well right let me try and uh, find my way out of this area I don't think there's anywhere else for me to go uh, apart from the uh, the way I got here as far as I can see anyway can I not jump over anywhere here nope okay let's go back down through this well then and uh, let's go back to the graveyard and then through the big pipe and uh, then I might try and head my way back to the middle because uh, I think that's where the uh, the crafting tables were so then hopefully I can make myself a diamond sword and oh oh there we go I thought I was going to be locked in here then but nope it did open up right now how did I get to this area I remember I came through a big pipe but where is the uh, the pipe on this side and oh no I got scared I was going to get stuck in this pit now <laughs> I seem to be doing quite well and so whenever I do well I'm just worried that I'm going to do something stupid and mock it all up <laughs> right so where was the entrance to the pipe oh that was a spider falling from a tree there that scared me a little bit um 
Oh, here we go, here we go. It was down by the tongue, wasn't it? That's it, it was down by the tongue. So let's go and uh, head back this way if we can. And uh, let's go and head back down through the pipe. There's a creeper up there, so I want to be careful he doesn't drop down on me. And oh, look, I can see someone. Gamer tags have been switched on. There is someone up above me over there. I don't think there's any way for them to easily get to me, uh, so I should be okay. But I do want to I do want to keep uh, an eye out, though, nonetheless. And so at least this way, I know no one should hopefully sneak up on me uh, because they have gamer tags on. So unless they're crouched and then gamer tags are invisible, I should hopefully be okay. I'm still getting hungry here, though, and I am starting to... to run out of food so uh, let me go and eat some of this bread and I do have a little bit of food left there we go I've got a little bit of raw beef that I can eat uh, if I get hungry again it's always very important to keep your hunger up uh, because then that way you can always sprint and then if you do get hurt uh, your health is going to start regenerating immediately and look there's some string on the ceiling there how cool uh, anyway so let's go try and find that crafting table is there oh look there is there's one in the middle uh, down there so let me try if I go and jump down here and then I'll go and take out the spider if I can get back spider leave it out and then I can go and jump down here. Is there any quick way down? No, I'll just go down the stairs. Let's play it safe, shall we? Let's get my hunger up. And then let's go and try and make that diamond sword. And then I should hopefully be set for victory. <laughs> I think I've been, I'm getting a bit too confident now. Whenever I get too confident, uh, that's when things end up going wrong. So let me try and very quickly get to the middle. Because I'm very exposed out here. Let me go and get to the crafting table. Quick as I can. Make myself the, the diamond sword. Go, 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 go. Quicker, quicker, quicker. Now let's run. Now let's run. Let's run. Which side should we go to? Uh, let's go uh, over to here for now. Oh, there's a doggy down there. Oh, there's a person down there. Oh, run away. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. <laughs> I saw the dog before I saw the lion. Well, let's get in here. Then I need to go and try and get my diamond sword out uh, as quick as I can. Oh, no, he's still chasing. He's still chasing. He's still chasing. Right, let's... um. Uh, invisibility myself and then let's try and slowness him and let me try and get up here to this pipe if I can and now let me try and get the the diamond sword out there we go I now have the diamond sword out I should hopefully uh, be able to do a little bit better now right He's got slowness on him, and so, well, I think he did. I think I hit him, so I might be able to, to push him back if I can. And this place looks amazing, doesn't it? I think this is from a Super Mario, uh, not 3D World, the um, the uh, N64 version. What one was that called? I can't remember what it's called. Yeah, I think this is the uh, the castle from that game, but I got my, my sword now. So let me have my sword next to the boat uh, so I can quickly switch between the two. And uh, let me see if I can go after Lime Maker. See how rubbish the invisibility potion is? <laughs> you can just completely see my armor running all over the place. Place. Oh, looks! Looks like they're fighting against each other. This is perfect. I might be able to run in and just take out whoever is strongest out of the uh, out of the two of them. Right. I don't want to get sandwiched in the middle though. That's the only problem. And here's Lion Maker in here. I'm going after him. I'm going after him. Oh no, it's lagging a bit. It's lagging a bit. Just keep swinging. Just keep swinging. Oh, he's trying to run away. And here comes Tom. Here comes Tom. Oh, Tom's got all diamond armor and stuff on. Tom is doing very well over here. And it looks like Tom is chasing after Lion Maker. Right. I am just going to go and try and take out whoever's. Oh, that's not Tomahawk. That's a mini god, I believe that is actually. I think that's mini god going after Lion Maker. Right. Oh look, look at the massive Goomba over there. That is amazing. <laughs> right. So whoever's left out of this battle, I think I'm going to go and try and take them out. Oh, did Lion Maker just throw an Ender Pearl there? Actually, oh, I think he did, but it was a rubbish one, and he didn't get very far at all. Right. And he's running straight to me. He's got to be really weak. He's got to be very, very weak. And is mini god going after me? Mini god did. Mini god is definitely going after me. Oh no, this is switched now. This is the opposite from what I wanted to happen, and I'm swigging there hitting me from so far back go 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 try and get them try and get them oh look they're going after each other again they're going after each other right i can try and have my golden apple to get my health back up there we go this is going to start putting my health back up this is such an epic fight all three of us going after each other i don't think line makers even using a sword anymore there we go i got a good arrow there on mini god maybe one more might take them out i'm not sure if it will though all right, let's just carry on the fight. Let's just carry on the fight. We're just going to keep hitting each other until someone's taken down. Lion Maker is trying to spawn zombies in. Really? It's come to that? <laughs> I do have a, a skeleton spawner. I could try and spawn one of them in. I'm pretty sure it'd go after me, though. I don't think Lion Maker even has a sword. Oh, here we go. He does have a sword. I don't think he has a, a very good one, though. I think it is just a gold one. I love how long this fight's been going on for. All right, looks like Lion Maker's on the run. I think I need to worry about Mini God more than Lion Maker because he seems to have all of the, the better things. And here we go. He was chasing after me. And I got a few good shots and now I can switch around and go after him. I want to keep uh, looking behind me though uh, just to make sure that a uh, lion maker isn't going to try and sneak up on me. There we go. Got some good hits on Mini God there. Mini God has got to be really weak and Mini God does have a, an iron sword as well. It's only uh, one worse a sword than my one. There we go. That was some good hits. That was some good hits. Mini God's got to be so weak. There we go. I was able to take them out but in comes lion maker. Can I take them both out? Can I do it? Can I do it? Let's have another golden apple. E -e 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 -t 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 -t. There we go. That's going to help me. Oh no, but my health's going down quicker than it's 
is going up. There we go. I got my health fully up. And now Lion Maker is on the run. <laughs> Come on, Stumpy. Come on, Stumpy. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. One more person to take out. Go on. You can get them. You can get them. Everyone cheer me on. I need it. <laughs> Lion Maker is just going to run, run, and run. Oh, look. Lion Maker is trying to steal all of the, uh, the diamond armor. All right. I do not want to give him a chance to put that armor on. But oh, no. I accidentally crouched then. All right. I don't want to give him a chance to put that armor on. I just got to stay on his tail. I just need to run, run, run as fast as I can uh, to try and make sure that he doesn't get a chance to put it on. He's just going to try and get away uh, from me, try and get somewhere safe, and then put on the diamond armor, and then he's going to turn around and go back after me. I keep getting stuck on all of these blocks, though, and I think he's the last one left. I'm assuming there's no one else left, but there might even be some more people around here. And what's this big thing over here? I think this is a, a big catapult we're running under here. And oh, is he trying to climb up it? I think he is. I think he tried to climb up it, but he kept failing. Now he's just hiding. Now he's just trying to hide. Right, I got him trapped. I got him trapped and I did it. I was able to, to take him out. Is that it? That was it. He was the last person in the game. I was able to win. What a round of Hunger Games. <laughs> that was so much fun. It was so close in the end uh, with the, uh, the three of us left, but I was just about able to take them both out. <laughs> Ah, oh dear. So that's going to end this video here. Hopefully you enjoyed uh, watching this map and uh, watching me play on it. Uh, there'll be a link in the description to the map builder, the other players, and a download to the map if you want to play on it for yourself. But for now, I want to thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!